Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. Hello there, my beautiful Pisces. I hope you are doing well today. I hope you enjoyed your lunch, your breakfast, your dinner, your snack, whatever you did. I just hope it was as special as you are. Pisces, you are my chart toppers here at Talia's Tarot. I look forward to hearing and seeing from each and every single one of you mother truckers every single day. Again, thank you for all the beautiful likes, all your beautiful comments, all your shares, all your subscriptions, all the donations to my channel. It is greatly appreciated and well received. So, what I need you to do right now, Pisces, is I need you to give me all your good, sexy, mother truck and fun loving energy. You can do that by clicking that like button. You can comment. You can share. You can subscribe. You can do all those sexy mother truck and things that I want you to do to me here at Talia's Tarot. So, you know what we're going to do. I'm going to put down the holy water, Pisces. If you didn't know, the gavel is in the repair shop. Something unexpected happened with the gavel. So, don't worry, the gavel will be okay. <laughs> so, let's check in on the energy of the person that my beautiful Pisces is dealing with at this time. Show me the energy of the person that my beautiful Pisces is dealing with at this time. Show me the energy of the person that my beautiful Pisces is dealing with at this time. Please show me the energy of the person that my beautiful Pisces is dealing with at this time. I just got hot. Wow. I just start burning up, guys. Burning on up, but burning on up. Oh, Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. Oh, shit, Pisces. <laughs> okay, Pisces. <clears throat> well, we have the star card. We have the six of swords down on the table. We have the nine of cups, Pisces. We have the oneness card here. And we have, crossing all that energy, Pisces is the emperor here. So, Pisces, Divine Masculine strongly coming in today. He's not just out on the table once, but he's on the table twice, Pisces. Pisces, this person is feeling very hopeful, feeling very optimistic here that they're going to have, that they're going to easily be able to come your way here. Yep, you got somebody coming your way, the Emperor, the Divine Masculine here. Nine of Cups, okay? They desire something here from you. And what do they desire more than anything right now? It's to have oneness here with you. There you guys are in space. That's how it sounds in space. Have you guys ever been in space? We can't hear anything. It's just like... But here the two of you are. In a tantric position, floating through space. This is sensuality. This is literally oneness. Pisces, this person feels like you complete their soul and their spirit. And not only do they think that, I feel that you feel the same way about this person. That you feel like this person completes you. Mm -hmm. So, you know what we got to do, Pisces. We just got to get into it, right? So... We're going to jump right into the Nine of Cups today. Normally, you know, I like to show up for a good sword fight. <laughs> we'll get into it. So, show me the Nine of Cups, please. What's this desire? What are they desiring? Show me the Nine of Cups, please. For Pisces person's energy, can you show me this Nine of Cups? Whew. Show me the Nine of Cups for Pisces person's energy. Sure. Damn. I wanted to fly over there. <laughs> nine of Cups is clarified by the Nine of Pentacles, Pisces. Oh, shit. <laughs> yeah, Pisces. You got somebody here that's single here. Um, that's been working hard here on their finances here. And they're having more success and more victory. And they're having the capability here to 
give more and offer more here when it comes to financials here. Mm -hmm. So show me more on this. It's the nine to the nine. So show me more on the nine to the nine. Show me more on the nine to the nine. More on the nine to nine is the hangman, Pisces. Pisces, here's your person. They're hanging out in the hangman tree here. They're happy, though, to be hanging out here in this hangman tree. And why is that? Because they're stuck on you, Pisces. They're stuck on you like gorilla mother truck and glue. And why are they stuck on you, Pisces? Well, because they want to take you to Pound Town City and they want to play with that titty, Pisces. And that's all that they can think of here. And this person feels like they need to make a decision here really quickly to come towards you here, Pisces. Oh, God, Pisces. This person can't stop thinking about you. No, nope, they can't. They're happy to be thinking about you too, Pisces. So, let's go to the sword fight, shall we? Show me the six of swords. It's not a sword fight, but I just like to say sword fight. These are my former pension days. <laughs> Show me more on the six of swords, six of swords, six of swords. Sure. Six of swords, here they are, Pisces. Coming to bring balance to you. Why? Because it's like they want to feel tranquility here in this situation. Pisces, this person wants to feel nothing but tranquil, tranquility here. And of course they want to feel tranquility because they already feel it when they're together with you here. I don't know if you guys have been together sexually or not. But whatever it is, this person is thinking about it. And they can feel it. It's just a feeling that this person gets that they know. That if you two come into union here, that this is exactly what's going to happen. It's going to be complete fulfillment here. And if you guys have already been together sexually, this person has already felt that. Whatever it is, Pisces, this person can't get you off their mind. No, they can't. And it's like this person wants to come and tell you the truth here. And I feel like they got more. They definitely have more to offer you here. In this situation, when it comes to their finances here. So show me more on this balance. Show me more on the balance. Balance, 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 balance. Show me more on the balance card, please. Oh, they're going to give me paper cuts today. That's fine. Show me more on the balance card, please, for Pisces person's energy. Ow. Damn, Sam. They're really making you... Okay, you want it accurate. They're making me shuffle. They really want me to shuffle these cards. Sure, they want me to shuffle the cards. <laughs> so I feel like there's been some resistance here when it when it's came to getting balance in this situation. In the past here, there has been some resistance here when it comes to getting balance here in this situation. And the person knows it. They could have felt like they were guarded here and defensive here towards you. But at the end of the day, it's like they don't want to feel guarded. They don't want to feel defensive here towards you anymore. And I don't know why they were feeling so defensive here. Probably because their ego, their insecurities, their thoughts here on how the situation could work. If it would work. All the things that, you know, come up in your head when you're trying to start a new relationship here. You know, you guys might it just, it, it can uproot everything. And taking a chance here, you know, it's a, it's a huge thing for anybody to do here. Because it's like going into the unknown here, Pisces. You just never know what's going to happen when you go into the unknown. So the only thing that you can sometimes do is just to six of swords it and go into the unknown. And here's your person. This looks pretty fucking unknown to me, right? Mm -hmm. It's cold. It's wintry. Good Lord knows what could happen out there. This person could freeze to death on their way to getting to you. But whatever it is, it's like this person is coming your way. And they don't want to be resistant here anymore. Mm -mm. So, show me more on the star card. What's this person feeling hopeful about? Show me more on the star. Yeah, they're, ho they're feeling hopeful here that they can give you a love offer here, Pisces. They're hopeful that you're going to accept this love offer, Pisces. Very hopeful. Show me more on the Sage of Cups. Sure. More on the Sage of Cups. 
Yep, this person here. This is like my fool's Russian. This is my Mortal Kombat card, you know? I'm fucking badass at Mortal Kombat. But here they are. Sitting there on the video game. I'm ready to rush in. I'm ready to rush in. When do I take action? Oh, I don't want to be a fool here. I could be a fool, rush in too quickly. I don't know what to do. But it's like they want to do it. So show me more on the Maiden of Swords. Move on the Maiden of Swords. Show me more on the Maiden of Swords. Yep, they're going to do it because they're going after their little Piscean fishy. There you are, Pisces. Yep. You're one big, sexy, luscious-looking, delicious fish, too, at that. <laughs> they might want to eat your sushi. Oh, I bet they do. This oneness card's down here. I know they want to eat the sushi. <laughs> but, you know, sushi tastes good unless it's rotten. Okay, guys? <laughs> Let's be for real here. So this person is going after their emotional gratification here. They feel like that you make them happy. So, show me more on the oneness card for Pisces person's energy, please. Show me more on the oneness card for Pisces person's energy. Whew. I want you to really shuffle it out today. Show me more on this oneness card for Pisces person's energy. Sure, more on the oneness card. Here they come, Pisces. They're on their horse. They're headed your direction. They might be doing. They might be taking their time doing it, but they're coming. They're reliable. This is a reliable energy here. Show me more. On the Knight of Pentacles. Yep. Pisces. This person has had a lot of fears, a lot of losses in their life here. <clears throat> and uh, they've had desperate times here. But they're releasing all their burdens here. Why? Because they want a new passionate beginning here with you. And the fucking penis popsicle flies a fucking truck out. <laughs> oh, shit. It. Crossing the penis popsicle. It is the lust card. Pisces, this person's got a lot of lust. They got a lot of passion here for you, right? They do. They're feeling like an untamed wildebeest coming out of the gates. Woo here they come, Pisces. This person might just rip off all their clothes and your clothes. And Pisces, it's the lover's card right underneath that. This is familiar love. Pisces, this person has chosen you. You are the chosen one, my golden child. <laughs> Eddie Murphy, by the way. <laughs> oh, Pisces. So, we're going to grab the white sage here. Okay, white sage. We're going to get the final messages on what this person wants to tell you before we close off this mother trucking reading. What else do you want to tell my beautiful Pisces before we close off this reading? They got a lot of passion. Here they come, Pisces. What else do you want to tell my beautiful Pisces? Oh, yeah, Ten of Cups. Not only once on the table, but now we have it twice on the table. Pisces, you make this person feel like a fucking giant-ass rainbow. <laughs> they feel rainbows and butterflies and pixies when they're around you. What else do you want to tell my beautiful Pisces before we close off this reading? Sure. Six of Pen coming out here, Pisces. They feel like they can have fairness here with you and balance here with you. That's what they want, Pisces. Fairness and balance. And the lover's card, Pisces. Not only did it come out and make its appearance once, but now we have it twice, Pisces. This person is in love with you, Pisces. Straight up. Straight up in love with you. Oh my God, Pisces. This is beautiful energy. So, if you enjoyed this reading, you know what to do. Click that like button. You can comment. You can share. You can subscribe. Do all those sexy mother trucking things that you want to do to me here at Talia's Tarot. I love you, Pisces. Bye-bye.